never thought we could have like especially in Camden here, you would have never thought about like anybody doing such a production, like focusing on the students that here in our school. I didn't know that we can all come together. Like I would never knew any of these kids. So yeah, I learned a lot from the uh, um, camera angles, how to work the camera and everything. So it was fun. Now every time I watch a movie, I'm like counting like, okay, that's one shot, that's another one. And I, and I just start counting when it starts changing into different shots. There was this one time, I think it was I was watching Avatar. And I was like, watch it, watch it. I bet you that's a different scene. They broke that scene into this, into this. And they, this is how, I'm going to tell you how they did this. And then he was like, Alexis, be quiet. I don't care. I just want to watch it. And I, was like, I was like, Uncle Steve, but it's not real. They're cutting the scenes into different parts. I bet they deleted a scene right there. He was like, would you stop? It's very rare that you find us intermingling within each other's grades. And then here we are all here, and we all work so well together that it was just yes. funny. Like, I never talk to freshmen. Never. Oh, I'm a senior. I don't talk to freshmen. Man. And then here we go with the twins. I talk to the freshmen now. I'm like, oh man, I go back on my word. I talk to like the sophomores, the juniors, and everybody, but like I never was, you know, like really like got into discussions or could now talk to them about big picture alliance. You know, it's more like, oh hi, oh okay, bye. But now it's more like, you know, like a more more of a connection with everybody. But I'm happy that I made it work. You know, I, I'm really happy because I, I got a lot out of it. Whether working with the camera, the boom was the best part. I, I like, I like the That's one job. I, I, I don't know. I liked it because like you had to hold it up and then they'd be like, okay, follow the boy. So you like following the person over top of them, and you know, you can't let the camera see you. you know, I it. I it's like it was spot. That's your job. I was actually yeah. most impressed yeah. about how you guys did pull together because uh, I know that you were all from different factions of our school. Um, and you all came together, and I think a lot of what uh, Big Picture did with the warm-up exercises immediately broke ice, uh, doing a shaking, you know, thing. You know, we're all the laughing and, and the, uh, the word game, uh, having to memorize, yeah. oh, things yeah. like that. You know, it really broke the ice, and uh, it really pulled together in working with the writing. And um, it, I was very impressed with how you guys really pulled together. Uh, you made an amazing movie. Uh, I've done this at a couple of the schools, and this is the, by far one of the best um, pieces of work I've seen done. I'm really impressed with all you guys. I've never really interacted with any of the freshmen or the sophomores. Uh, a little bit of the juniors. But I mean, like, we would sit down doing the, you know, writing the script and everything and listen to each and every one of your ideas. It's like, y'all are really creative. And it's like, wow, like, it was just amazing. Like, I mean, so many people have so many talents, but they don't want to, like, express it. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, when y'all, we would just send, and that actually, um, Big Picture Alliance helped me with that, is to have more confidence in myself, and also just get what I, what people tell me that I should embrace, which is acting or anything with film. So it's actually being around y'all, and basically me being, me being me, you know, me and myself, what I love to do, and y'all just made it comfortable for me. So I want to like, Thank you for that because it was actually had a really good time. Like, so. I don't know if this is from an artist perspective, but like I know we're all from Camden, and you said that other people might see this, and I think that's amazing because you know when you watch the movies, what do you always see? The same actors and the same people, <laughs> and you feel like you know directors don't really look for actors, and I think it's amazing to find that Curtis or even myself or even Donovan come from such a place that has so much stereotypes and we could all make something together and no one really looks for us and I think it's very important that we're putting ourselves out there. Hey, you don't want to look for me? Well, here I am and I think I'm amazing. I think everybody's amazing. That's why I want to do it again because, you know, Camden is really a big place and there is people there who want to be heard. So, <laughs> it was very helpful being in the because after something happened in my life, I stopped writing completely. Like, I only would write like because I had to, like in classes and everything. But um, there was a time where I used to write a lot and I used to enjoy it and then I just stopped. But, um, oh my God, I don't want to go. All right. Um, but being able to see this, it helped me like, come out of my shell. And um, I was able to start writing and doing something I would do now. So, yeah, thank you. Even though some people don't know what they're going to do, like when they get older, and they could look at it like, oh my God, that's so interesting. Like, I like the way this person, I like the way Alexis act in the movie, or the way uh, Josh act, or I like the camera angles that such and such did. And I, I, I just love all of this, the editing. 
I mean, get involved, like do something you don't know. You might be actually good at it. You might actually love it because it's actually a fun uh, thing to do. Acting, film, I mean, acting, directing, writing, all of this is fun. The film is just fun. It's using your imagination. Some people are afraid to use their imagination, which film can actually express your imagination. Most people look at the youth of today's generation as like, oh, we're violent, we have no other way of communicating with each other besides punching each other in the face and cursing at each other. But this movie brought their violent, like they weren't violent, they didn't like each other. But they used their knowledge in different ways to come back at each other. Not, like, not just verbal violence or harassing each other or anything. It was like, you had the power, but he showed you that you're not the only one in power. He owns himself. So it bring it brought that's the lesson. Like you have your own power. No one else can bring you down. And you don't have to use violence or attacking other people or putting them down to just show that you have power over yourself. I think also the story itself, the story is very real. And I feel when people watch movies, you know, it's a lot of things like the way it's just like, oh I love you, oh let's kiss. That didn't happen. It started slow. <laughs> and I think it's the fact that when you watch a movie, I, I experience this with my cousin, I experience with myself. That's not realistic. That doesn't happen. Mm -hmm. A lot of those things don't really happen. And when you see something as pure as, oh, I think it's pure as this, it's just like, wow, things can really be okay if you just take it slow. And no matter what happens, there's a way to use your own voice. And I think that this movie brought it instead of being so off. Like, this was imaginative, but the movies just go so way out. And, like, you know, I think. Some people need to see like what Christina said, the real world and how youth are can really be and I think that's amazing. Just step up. Don't ever look down at yourself or like, no, I can't do it. Don't doubt yourself. You got this. You got this. <laughs>